today I drove about four hours from the workway. We drove south to a place called Cooperative. Um, the temperatures dropped quite a lot, so it's been a little bit chilly. But um, it's I think it's on the way back up to about 20 odd degrees. So um, I mean, when it drops from 35, you know that it's going to be a little bit cold. <laughs> you just feel it unnecessarily. Um, anyway, we uh, are part parked outside Plovdiv um, by a river last night, had quite a quiet night which was good and drove into the city today so I'm going to walk around the old town and just see what's happening. I think I want to take them home. Look at them. They're so cute. I think Mama's pregnant again. So I'm not sure the fate of these little pups because they're quite ribby. Aww. Otto's not bothered in the slightest. Morning. So the temperature was pretty cold last night. I had to wake up at about three o'clock in the morning and sort myself out a hot water bottle because I was freezing. Um. Anyway, we are in the mountains and um, stopped at this bear park, this bear rescue center um, foundation set up by Bridget Bardo. Um, it's basically a rescue center for um, dancing bears, so bears that were used by gypsies and like street performers um, so hopefully I'm gonna have a look around and
who's getting used to the bears. So they're kept separate um, depending on who can socialise with who. The, there was one behind and she's only been here for uh, three weeks. She was rescued from Albania. She was pacing up and down a little bit, but she, I, she's probably not settled, but they seem to be really happy here. And she said that they all hibernated and they only hibernate if they're well um, and feel safe. So that's, it's really nice. We're now leaving the bear park in Bulgaria and driving about four hours, not including stops, because probably we'll have to stop for fuel and food and a wee. Um, and obviously to cross the border um, into uh, Montenegro. And I need to buy insurance on the border because it's not part of the EU. So we'll see how that goes. That could be a bit of a drama. But um, hopefully at some point, this afternoon slash evening I get to Skopje um, which is the capital and I'm going to spend at least tomorrow there as well so check it out it's meant to be kind of cool Today, me and Douglet are exploring Skopje. So we had a little walk around last night. I've parked just the other side of that uh, park there. And um, yeah, we, we had a look around and it was really nice, really pretty, all lit up. So I'm probably gonna stay tonight as well. So I'll get a few videos of the area when it's all lit up, cause it looks really nice. So it rained this morning, um, <clears throat> but we're gonna go and explore the castle um, and basically just see what's happening. So stuff like this makes me pretty sad. You, you get that a bit in Eastern Europe, just uh, some sites of interest and stuff. They just get trashed and people just spread litter everywhere. It's just, it's really shit, basically. And then uh, they don't seem to invest money in making it nicer or even protecting it. Like there's no barrier to stop people getting in, so yeah. loves attention. Oh, is that nice? 
YouTube. So, say hi. hi. <laughs> oh, is this a video? Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> so we've come to uh, Canyon Matka, Matka Canyon. Matka, yeah. Yep. yeah. Yeah, and I've met some people along the way. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so, uh, Kerry and Giles. Giles, yeah. So, and Ozzy and a Brit. Uh, so, happy days. So, we'll see where our adventure goes. <laughs> <laughs> 